We begin tonight with the gunfire that claimed a man's life and shattered an Omaha neighborhood's sense of security. Good evening, I'm Rob McCartney. I'm Julie Cornell. We brought you the breaking news live at 4. The shooter opened fire near 49th and Miami. KTV News Watch 7's Cal Larson's live at police headquarters with this Crime Stoppers alert. Cal. Julie, Rob, right now, not much from Omaha police. There's no motive, no description of the shooter. People who live in the neighborhood just hoping they don't have to see this type of violence again. Gunfire claims a man's life, sending bullets into at least one home near 49th and Miami. As police work to cut one of those bullets out of a wall, neighbors plead for the violence to stop. I just want peace in, the fam in this neighborhood and peace out outside. Uh, it's just, I thought, uh, here we go again. The shooting shattered windows on both sides of this home. Marlene Croft lives nearby. She was driving home when she saw police taping off multiple blocks. When I turned and saw the flashing lights block up, I thought, what now? John Batard lives one street over from the crime scene. He was letting his dogs out at that time. Heard a quick pop, and then a second pop, pop. That, I mean... I'm no spring chicken, so I guess I kind of knew what the sound was. Batard says it's not a bad neighborhood. It is unusual for my neighborhood. And that he'd have no problem knocking on any of his neighbor's doors. They're walking their dogs. I'm walking my, my dogs. It's it's not a bad neighborhood. It's, it's a nice, clean-cut community. Reminds me of a small town. And that's why he can sum up how he feels in a single word. I have no other word but appalled. Again, not much information yet from police and no word of any arrest. Call Crime Stoppers if you saw something you think may help. That number, 402-444-STOP. We are live in Omaha tonight. Cal Larson, KTV, Newswatch 7.